start. <laughs> Did you finish? I'll start until you finish. Brenda. Brenda. Back up <laughs> Brenda. My, Brenda. Back up into my hands. <laughs> Hello, everybody. And welcome to the Rand Stumpy Show. How is everybody doing on a fantastic fucking Tuesday? What's up? Mezzer, how you doing? Tomahawk, you're an ass. But how you doing, too? <laughs> what up, Chili? What would he, would he expect anything James. else? Top my James! No. Not really. Not from him. You look like you have a lot of experience making that, making that motion, Rant. Well, yeah. Like 33 years of it. I mean, is that, I mean, it's one of the, one of the things. Do you have your pro card? Is that what you're saying? Yes, you do. I do. Okay, I haven't, I I haven't, I haven't submitted my application yet. Hey, uh, what's going to. on, Candy? Hey, Candy, what's going on? Yeah, yeah, I need to. You should, because it gets you into so many other exclusive activities. I'm an ass. Tell me something I don't know. <laughs> you're among friends. Yeah, here. I was about to say. Yeah, and and it's we're, we're all asses here. I mean, obviously, to one degree or another. Look at our uh, <laughs> our title of today's stream, mm, Sofa King Fart Fest. Tuesday Sofa King. Yeah, you fart have fest. to be, yeah, yeah. The the one who who blasts the cushion the most is declared the Sofa King. Yeah, and then that, you got big, we that taught begs a question. Ed. Over the average, like, what 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 is uh what is the average house like? <laughs> Thank you, Chili. <laughs> Thanks, Chili. Uh. Yeah, speaking on that, you know, <laughs> let's 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 go ahead and dive right in. Uh, what? How long do you say the uh, average couch? Like, you know, how how long do you keep a couch on average? Um, what would a couch last you? Five years, ten years, uh, twenty probably, years? Probably t- it depends on the person. Yeah, it depends on it, if, if you have kids or not. If I recall, pets. your parents had a certain couch for quite some time. Oh yeah. So you think it's got like a fart mileage on it? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I'm I'm th- like. Hey, six thousand, yeah, six thousand farts or nine shards. Yeah, yeah, it's <laughs> it's literally that. But what what I'm getting at Tom is, Tom, like I farted so loud today at work, everyone thought our manager was making a general announcement. That's awesome. That's so a apparently good one. he's an ass. That's a good one. Yeah, that's what you call talking out of your ass. <laughs> but if you bought a couch brand new and weighed the cushion, and then weighed the cushion again ten years later after it collected farts and stuff, would it be heavier? Would the particulates okay. have added weight over the course of a decade enough to notice a difference? Okay, uh, I'm going to say yes and no. Okay, so how, okay, it's, e- it's either one or the other, but I'll let you explain your reason. Okay, <clears throat> so no, because it's gas, it's air, right? It's, the, but it's, it's gas. One can imagine that. <clears throat> every time you sit down, it poofs it out, right? True, Okay, but there's now, probably some particulate matter that sure, follows. Sure, sure. You know, but you know what it is those, probably those, full after of those tips to Taco Taco Bell and everything. You uh, know, you know what it is probably full of what bodily fluids. Yeah, I mean that might be sleep, true. You sleep on the couch, you sweat. Yeah, puke on the couch because you're drunk. I don't even know what else you do on the couch. That's 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 fine. You beach meat on the couch because you're lonely. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, because you're not going to do it in your yeah. bed when nobody's home. Exactly. Yeah. No, no. I, I would imagine like it, it begs the it question: the skin cells are lost a year. Ugh, fuck, that's gross. Probably some of the deceased cells of your <laughs> anal walls. Too. Depending upon how severe the farts are, or depends right. on where you ate at last. <laughs> that's true. That's true. I imagine Taco Bell farts <clears throat> add more weight to it than say you know something more clean. So they're heavier farts, right? They are. They are more dense. That's my th- I, that's, that's my theory, theory though. That's, uh, what you're that's, to. I'm, that's my theory, and I'm sticking to it. I need to submit a paper to a science journal, you know, a couple of months from now. I mean, we already started me- making our own definition, yeah. so I mean, why not? I have to compile my methodology and stuff. So submit a thesis to <laughs> yeah, like yeah, the, yeah. I, the I'm, science I'm get, world and see what I'm happens. Getting the data points, yeah, I, Mesra, exactly, <laughs> and, and yeah, tell me both with. Uh, Never trust a fart after eating Taco Hell. Fart That's smells true. because there's tiny bits. That's of what I was it. referring to was the well, particulate yeah. matter that embeds itself in the cushion every time. So Just after ten years <clears throat> of farts, what do you suppose the weight difference is? True, true. It would be interesting. But on Mezzard's account, think of all the times you walked in public and you've literally had other people shit in your nose. Oh, dude! Like, uh, uh, take the average <laughs> air sample. It would probably horrify you to know what's what's floating around out there. Depends on where you live. Some places are worse. Well, I'm than saying others. go to like a subway or some shit like that. Yeah, you know, I mean, I don't mean like a restaurant. I'm talking about an oh, actual God. like mass transit thing. Like, no, that's nah, like a teeming cesspool. That's what I'm of saying. Hate. Yeah, 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 there's all kinds of nasty ass goings on there. Uh, ah, yeah. I just that's just awful. Oh yeah, 
Yeah, there ain't enough, there's no good way to put that either. No, there isn't. There isn't. That is that is past any good. There's no redeeming qualities to that. I mean, I've seen people sleep on there. They shit on the subways. They piss on the oh, subways. Yeah. They yeah. I've bump ridden ri- on the subway, subway one time in DC, and it was I was not impressed. I bet it smelled awful. It was pretty gross. Now, see, if you went to Japan, <laughs> you could get a job as a subway pusher. I've seen that where they literally force yeah people yeah yeah in, yeah they pack and, them and, into the subway that something you know I think I'd actually like that job. You just to push people around yeah. all day. Yeah, exactly. Literally. Yeah. And it's not assault. Think about uh, yeah. that. They're literally giving you an exception. You you have an exemption from assault. But that's what Man. you get to do. You get to assault people, and you're paid to do it. You know how bad it would suck? How if, great is that? How bad it would those suck for people, the people around you Those if people you were are probably the, the happiest people. Probably. You, can, you could go to work angry. You're going to go home happy because you can <laughs> take it out on people all friggin' day. <laughs> And you're going to have good upper body strength. Like, there's health benefits, too. You could be the person in the middle yeah. and have, like, horrible gas. Like, you had some bad kimchi or some bad uh, squid. You know, yeah. everyone around you in that subway that got crammed in, like sardines, yeah. is going to suffer. Oh, yeah. And it's fantastic. Oh, yeah, you know it. I wouldn't, mi- I wouldn't mind, like, going to Japan just to fart on a crowded subway. I'd like to ride that bullet train that goes like 180 miles an hour. That'd be pretty it's tight. Freaking awesome. That'd be pretty tight. I gotta say, I mean, the fastest shit in the world. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Ooh, another beef. Yummy. No, I gotta. I gotta say that job Thank would. You, Chili. That job would be kind of cool. That would be. Yeah. You just let you see somebody like getting a run start. <laughs> just. <laughs> Some of them have. They, they, they've actually thrown their shoulders into. That's them. great. I know. Like, think about that. You literally get to just destroy people practically. Yeah. Even old Granny Gang, get in there. Nah, exactly. Dude, take it out on Granny. Yeah. You know those people go home happy. How could you not? Yeah, I don't know how you You know could. what they need? They need, like, monkey bars <laughs> right there so you can hang on and, like, put kick people no, in. No, you know what they need? Like, those, you ever see those? Uh, you remember the show American Gladiators? Yeah. You remember those pugil sticks they had? <laughs> That's what you need. You just come up and start... Just, or you take it on the end and just start exactly. Pushing That's it, in. it works either way. You can either like hold it sideways and push like three at a time, <laughs> or you can just if there's just jab the that one, one asshole yeah. back. Exactly. In. <laughs> That's man. Sign me up, right? <laughs> All right. Today the you laugh, you lose yes. challenge day. When, whenever, yeah, whenever, whenever you're you wish, MP. But before we get there. I do have one thing. I, oh, okay. I, I had a I had a thought that came to me today, and I that's, want to share it with everybody. That's always dangerous. Well, it's not really a thought. It's actually something I've experienced. Okay. Have you ever been asleep and had to piss so bad that you dreamt that you pissed the bed? No. Or like I have, you've had where you have had to, to wake so up bad, though and go piss, but it hurt like so bad that you're hurting. Yeah, like I've I've I've, I've Chilly, had it. Yes, I've had it wake <laughs> me up, but I've never dreamed about it. I, I can't tell you, I've actually had this, I actually had this not long ago. Yeah. And I also had it, you know, younger, of course, but I had to piss so bad and I, my body just did not want to wake up. I thought it was in a dream. Yeah. And then I had, should in be, the dream that I went, no. Oh, okay. In the dream, I went. You, you sure you didn't wake up with a with your hand in a bowl of water like MP tried to pull that shit on you? I wouldn't fucking doubt it. I was about to say. No, like, I didn't. I'm thinking if you ever did, like, that, that's going to be your bet. It's oh. called bedwetter syndrome. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, uh, Tom. Uh, Tom, I went to church with my grandma and grandpa a long time oh, ago. Man. The church had a wooden had wooden pews, and I remember my grandpa fall asleep and let oh, one yeah. rip so hard it made the whole pew shake. Old thirty, <laughs> all all thirty odd feet of it. There wow. was like three other families sitting on that when one of the kids started giggling and wouldn't stop. Oh, that's Good not times. fair. That's not you can't you can't get on to somebody for laughing at that. No. Especially Absolutely a kid. not. There's, it's not fair. You might be like, shh, shh, stop, stop. But, I would laugh. But there's no, yeah, exactly. I would exactly. laugh as an adult. I mean, yeah. <laughs> shit. I'd laugh right now. It'd be freaking great. That was that awesome. Is, that sounds man, pretty epic. Talk about a ripper. Yeah. You know? and, and you know, though, those wood, wooden seats and stuff like you see in classrooms and everything, they got good acoustics. Yeah, they do. Really good acoustics. They conduct sound rather well. <laughs> so, But for real, I had to piss so bad that okay. in my dream, I dreamt that I was, I got to relieve myself and take a piss. But you woke up needing to pee severely. Well, and I Or thought, did you not wake well, up? Did you just, sleep through? I, I was like, okay, so here's how it happened. I was like, oh, yeah, I'm getting some relief. I, it, but it still hurts. Then all of a sudden I'm like, 
wait a minute, jump out of bed. I'm like feeling around like, okay, I didn't piss myself. I got to go. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, you, you must got to go pretty bad when you're dreaming about peeing. Yeah, my dream's like, wake the fuck up. It's like, yo, Are you going to piss the damn bed? Yeah. Yo. I'd be good. the one telling her aunt to stop laughing. Yeah. Uh, believable. Yeah, no, absolutely. Very 100%. believable. I, I think that's why you started seeing cushions introduced on pews. <laughs> it wasn't because of, like, comfort and stuff. Like, they probably ostensibly told people that that's what it was about. But the reason I think that they added cushions to pews was to cut back on the fart acoustics. It was yeah. basically, they're, they're, they're less cushions as they are fart silencers. Yeah, pretty much. Because we fart grew up in a church like that. I've never seen him leap it. Wow. There you go. Yeah. Oh, I had to go, dude. I was fucking hurt. Huh. I, I had to get to go. I, I it People hurt to move. The bed and youth have those exact dreams. Wow, I'm lucky. I don't know if luck's what I would call it, but hey, <laughs> I guess it's better than pissing the bed, though. My pissing sphincter is tight. Congratulations. <laughs> should be so proud. I am. But you know what? You should get a certificate. You know, put that on the wall in the Where house. Where can I get that from? A urologist, probably. Sweet. You know what? Call a urologist and ask them if no. you can get a uh, uh, a certificate of appreciation for your pee hole. The last I'm time sure I talked to a fucking urologist, I got my nuts. I <laughs> fart in your gender direction. Your mother was a hamster and your father smelt of elderberry. <laughs> That's good. Oh, good God. Thank you, Jilly. He's got a good stream control. Get him the blue ribbon. Don't cross the streams. <laughs> Thank you, Chili, for the 200 bits. And uh, uh, Fantastic. Thank you. I thought that you did it direction. Your mother was a hamster, and your father smelled of elderberries. I've got so many stories of drunk sailors coming back to the ship and pissing in the wrong places because I thought they were in the head. That's hilarious. <laughs> I mean, when you got to go. Uh, when you got to yeah, go, yeah, you got to go. Just like that part in... Uh, was a super troopers when he's pissing on the gas tank. No, when the, when he they pull the dude over and he just yeah. starts pissing on his car. Oh right yeah, there. yeah, yeah. And the guy's like, "What the fuck?" Is, when you gotta, gotta go, go, you gotta, gotta go. go. <laughs> and he's not wrong. No, but I wonder if they gave the guy a ticket or if they just let him off with a warning after that. They shouldn't have given him a ticket. I mean, I, I think that's pretty much your cue to just drive away slowly. Yeah, like I don't think they're gonna stop you at that point. I, I probably wouldn't. Farva. <laughs> yeah. Shenanigans? So, yeah, uh, th- I'm not talking to urologists ever again. Okay. La- nice. la- last time they went with a knife to my nuts, and I, uh, no, no bueno. MP. Meow. Oh, all right, meow. All right, meow. All right, meow. Meow, what is so yeah, damn yeah. funny? Meow, what is so damn funny? Do I look like a cat to you, boy? Am I jumping around all nimbly bimbly from tree to tree? Oh, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of the car. Right, meow. <laughs> That's, that was good, God. No, oh, now we're going to be quoting that. Well, I love that movie, though. What's really funny, I'm sure you heard us at the beginning of the show, we were clo- quoting another one of our favorites is uh, Perfect Hair Forever. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I was lucky enough to find that. Ah, right. I just love the 10th meow. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, no, it, it wasn't It wasn't because he was done. He just was just like, hmm, hmm, hmm. He, uh, he was holding up nine. He had to get 10. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah Farva did nine. Or no, no, Thorne did no. nine. Farva yeah. was like, Farva was oh, a douche. Say mal, meow. Yeah. I'll say move. For for, for 20, 20 bucks, <laughs> I'll call a guy chicken fucker. <laughs> License registration, chicken fucker. You know what's fucker! you know what's hilarious? That was his real parents. Yeah, those were yeah. his parents that he did that to. Could you do I, that to yours? Oh hell yeah. <laughs> oh hell yeah. Yeah. No, no, straight up. Could abs- you do it to mine? Yeah, but then, <laughs> he's a little more hesitant yeah. on that one. Yeah, well, it depends. Do, do they know, or or is it a complete surprise? Complete surprise. Yeah, I think it's. <laughs> Chicken fucker was the best. He do that for a Could Klondike you do bar. It to yours. Well, are they knowing about it or no? No surprise. I don't think I could do that to my mom. Surprise, surprise. I don't know. Lies, lies. See, because you know, my dad would 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 jump out and chase both our asses down. Yeah, he he would want to know what the hell just happened. He jump, what the fuck you say? You'd have to like explain at that point. It's a joke. It's a joke. I got your joke right here. That and when they were testing out the bullet, oh god, the bulletproof cup. Now that's something I. I How you feeling? Good enough to fuck your mother. <laughs> I uh, doubt after it, that. Yeah, with the rookie, does it hurt? I, I you gotta feel a little. I'm pinch. gonna go out on a limb and say after that you wouldn't be in the mood to fuck anything. Like. 
No. Because while it may stop the round from going through it, you know, you assume, still got that energy. Assume it's a nine millimeter, and that's about four hundred and twenty foot pounds or so. That's and, a pretty good shot to the nuts. Yeah, and <laughs> play baseball my whole life. Yeah, cups don't really help. Yeah, they they help. They don't prevent. It still hurts like hell. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how, how much energy do you suppose a seventy mile an hour fastball carries. I'm sure they've quantified that. Seventy mile an hour well, fastball. You could, you could you could actually go Dude, by the mass weak of sauce. the baseball. Okay, fine. Well, hey, what were, what was the fastest when you were playing? When I was playing, the fastest <coughs> that I caught was eighty three. Okay, so but when it suppose... comes off the bat, it's oh faster. Well, yeah, that's different. But okay. how many people get hit in the balls coming off the bat? So I've it, seen people take it off the face and shit. Yeah, and that's bad. Now I've had. Foul just balls come back your nuts after me. Cracked up. Pretty much. Pretty much. It keeps you from uh, losing your nuts. Yeah. Doesn't keep it from hurting. Oh, there you go. Oh, hey. hey all right. Thank you, Jelly. I, I'm legitimately curious about this because, I mean, it's easy to quantify. Yeah. Mass times velocity. I mean. Yeah, so there, there's mass times of velocity. Uh-huh. Mass times of velocity squared. So, see, the kinetic energy equation just gives us an energy insight why it's so hard to throw at 90 plus. Okay. For a pitcher to throw 80 miles an hour, the ball needs to have 92.7 joules of kinetic energy at release. Oh. Hmm. That's, that's, that's quite a hit. That but sucks. See, and that's the thing, too. What? How far is the uh, the pitcher's mound from front, uh, from the plate? Oh, fuck, I don't remember. Is it 60 feet? Something like Something that. Something like that. Something like Somewhere that. Somewhere in that neighborhood? I don't fucking so remember. So it's going to be losing some speed, but, but the point being is it's a lot, to, especially if you get hit in the nuts. Yeah, it's a whole I, you know, lot. I've, I've actually had that. It, it's not fun. You see, I'm sure you've seen the clip of that one player get. Yeah, that was bad. Yeah. And that guy looked like he took it like square in the teeth, it looked like. Yeah, it did. It was bad. Now, I've had one that was pretty bad where they foul tipped it, and it literally bounced under my glove and then came up into my yeah, nuts hit you, hit you behind, behind the, cup. the cup. How did it hit you in the nuts behind the cup, though? It came back somehow just the perfect like that didn't angle. Just, that didn't just hit you in the grundle. It, it, it hit it, you in no, the No, I got my nuts. And what was funny is I just. One of the million shots. Oh, yeah. You want to talk oh, about one was, of the million. Yeah, no shit. But I don't I, know I how much. Up yeah. And fell over. I don't know how much heat Randy Johnson put on that one, but that bird just exploded. Dude, he threw in the 90s. Feathers. Randy, Randy Johnson threw in the 90s. Yeah, but that was. It, that's one of those things you can't help but be amazed by that. When he hit like, that bird. Think, they clocked yeah. it at like 95 or 96. Think about the fact, if that bird would have taken off a half second earlier or a half second later, he'd have missed. Right. Entirely. But he just got disintegrated by 100% baseball. 100% perfect. All that came together, and he, he got demolished. Here's the crazy shit. PETA, the animal activist bullshit, oh tried to fucking sue him. How? Like they he, said he did it on purpose. That's an act of God, man. That ain't even freaking, like... That bird was someone horrible in the past yeah. life, and God's like, you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck That's you. what You've I'm saying. Like, there's so much... Vaporized. Like, he did. There's so many variables in, that could have happened in that. There's no way in hell you could make somebody responsible You see for it. feathers <clears throat> in a mist, and it's gone. Yeah. Yeah, it's that's just like... That's it. It was like a damn magic trick. Yeah. Ta-da! Yeah, I'm going to make this bird disappear. <laughs> Ta-da! It's gone. It was impressive. The bird was almost the same size as the baseball, too. You got to think that that baseball probably had more mass than that bird. Their, their bones are quite more, small. Definitely more mass. Yeah. So whatever momentum that bird had, it, it was immediately canceled out. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Junk I have a scar on my lip from a grand slam through two pitchers' nets. Damn. Yep. That happens. I never played baseball. I played football, and I got plenty of freaking scars from that. I broke my foot. I've been hitting the head with the baseball. I've been hitting the back of the head with a bat. I had to get stitches in my chin one time when uh, my freaking uh, chin guard slipped back and I caught the corner of somebody's face mask. Ooh, ow. Cut my chin open pretty good. I got back to the sideline. I was like, what is that? And it died a piece of skin just like hanging down. There's Ugh. blood just covering the front of my uniform. I had to go get, I get like five stitches from that. You you got a lot of stitches in your chin, dude. I have a lot of sti- I have scars all over my face. I'm like, just saying, most your of them chin are, mostly. Yeah, I've got. I had. I got three on there. The hotel. And I got another one there. That was from uh, the freaking IED corner of the mouth. I had stitches. That was from yep. the IED. This was from the IED. This was from surgery. This was from. Uh, I didn't get stitches in this one, so that don't count. But that was from uh, working on that AR, and I was trying to. 
crank it down in the re- uh, teeth on the wrench. <laughs> bent and this one's from a 50 cal. Yeah. Yeah, and then I have a scar on my retina, too. I didn't even find that out till I went and got glasses. She was like, you know you have a scar on your retina? I was like, no, that's a new one. <laughs> well, you did get stung in the eye by a wasp. That was different. I actually have another scar. He, he's, he's legit been stung in the eyeball yeah, by a wasp. Yeah, directly in the eyeball. And like it no permanently shit. scarred the, the, what do you call the sclera, the white of your yeah. eye? Yeah. I have a permanent, like, spot in the corner of my eye from yeah. that. Yeah, really. I, I can Dude, see it looking I, at him. Literally, like, I, I have, yeah. It, we ain't got time to go over all Life the damn... Life hates yeah, you right All now. the damn scars and shit I've... Yeah, and everything I've broken and everything. Yeah. So no. are we going to have, like, a compare scars episode? You, you know you're not going to win that one. Oh, I know I'm not. But my uh my back looks like fucking polka I stung by a yellow jacket while doing Tough Mudder. Oh, yellow jacket. They, they sting. Yeah. I remember uh, we were... Uh, that One of the times at uh, Chain of Lakes, we were horseback riding, and one of them stirred up a nest of yellow jackets. Yeah. I got stung on the leg. Uh Oh, on the forehead. I bet that hurt. Ouch. The, Ow. The worst, th- the worst thing I've ever been stung by was one of those uh, velvet wasps, though, the cow ants. Yeah. Those hurt like a son of a bitch. Whatever I got when I was surfing in Galveston in my foot. Oh, I, was I in remember the hospital that. For and did they week. ever even figure out what that was? No, I even no, had an infectious just, disease doctor just come just flying from Houston. Chalk that up to meh. Yep. Meh. meh. Wow. I, say, I mean, you got to remember, like, there, there, there's still medical mysteries that happen. Yeah. Like, people mm-hmm. get any random infection and shit from, like, you know, working in their garden or something like that, and then it's like, right. oh, we don't know what this is. In my back, like yeah. if you uh, look at my back, mm-hmm. it looks like white dots all over my back, hmm. because uh, what I was, uh, I've been in the same industry <laughs> like most of my life. So as a kid, I was a teenager and a young adult. I was going and wiring houses. Yeah, and you get into those eaves. Oh, the nail, the uh, not right. even the, uh, there are nails, but I uh, caught my shoulder one time. On those uh, big metal squares that are nothing but spikes that they do for yeah, the joists. That's, that's for the uh, holding the wood together yeah. for hurricane yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know what they call those things, but Me I either. caught my shoulder on one one time and, and on the corner of it, and those fuckers are sharp. But getting down in those eaves, you've got all the nails coming through oh, for yeah. the, uh, the shingles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it you was stand bad up enough too quick having to work in like 120 plus degree heat in those attics. Yeah. You stand like, up too quick, you get all those nails in your back. Yeah, I did that multiple times. Yeah. Wearing white shirts, you come out, you got red dots all over oh, your yeah. back from the blood. Yeah, no, I have to see. Wasn't very pleasant, but it made going through the electroshock therapy section feel like child's play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Them yellow jackets, they pack a pretty good wall up for a small little uh wall. Little thing, yeah. I got stung in Afghanistan too one time. We were searching this compound and we went in at night and there's this thatched roof and you know, the sun had come up. So I didn't need my nods. I flipped them up right. out of my way on my helmet and checked under that area and came walking out. And my nods brushed through that thatch roof. There's a wasp nest in there. Oh. One of them got between my uh, armor. Oh, my dude. It got me twice on the neck and then once again on the finger when I had to dig him out. Fuck that. The fucking what section? Oh, she was referring to tomahawks. Yeah. <laughs> Electroshock therapy. Ouch. Yeah. yeah, he got me twice on the neck and then once on the finger. Son of a bitch. What a dick. I know. I crushed What kind of wasps do they have over there? That, those looked a lot like the guinea wasps that we have here. But they also have uh, Asian giant hornets. Those oh. are a little bit different. Yeah, those There's things. There's huge orange and black bastards. Those are those murder hornets they were talking about a while back? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The, but the literally these things, like, if, if you, like, decided to eat outside one time, like, the, the you know, around the trash cans... Full yeah. of hornets. Dude, you, they'd fly in there. You'd see them flying off with pieces of, like, steak and shit. <laughs> like, these things did not fuck around. I'm serious. Like, this, thing, over there this thing would literally, like, come after your food. It didn't care if you were sitting there eating. Like, this thing was just Take like, it out of your mouth. You. So yeah. they're trying to take just a bite of steak, wood, comes, takes and, like, it off your fork. And yeah, it's like, it, like, come <laughs> up there. And it, like, dared you to do anything. So, what you gonna do? <laughs> what, you gonna, what you gonna do, bro? This shit's huh? pretty what good. You gonna bro, do? This shit's pretty good, bro. I'm gonna come back for seconds. It's a bunch of wires hanging down. Oh, oh, from Tough Mudder. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. All oh, the wires okay. I hanging forgot down. they do yeah, that. Yeah, I forgot about I that. I never have run any of those. There was uh, one ch- obstacle course challenge I'm too out of we shape. Did. In best Russian accent, no need. I will tell you everything I know. <laughs> <laughs> that was best Russian accent I could. Uh, hmm. Dude, not, I not, not bad, Boris. Do you think so? Yeah. Thank you. MP, you ready for that? Uh, Try not to laugh challenge. She she can drop it on us at any time. 
Yeah, a- anytime. You're, you're we're quite ready. welcome, MP. We're, we're ready to ruin yeah. your day. We've had our laughs, and uh, we've watched yeah. some uh, perfect hair forever, so we've got our laughs out. Yes, but I want to lay down two rules. Is that T-W-O or the rules? Yeah, your spelling is lacking, grasshopper. <laughs> yes. Your grammar is... <laughs> Two. There's okay. a rule. So right. Farts. Yeah, 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 yeah. Farts. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> yeah, farts are an unfair advantage. That, yeah, that's not fair. That's not fair at all. Yeah, if you put a bunch of farts in no there, no farts. <laughs> we should have said no farts. Yeah, redeem no farting. All right. What's the two rules? What right. do you no, consider? I'm sure she's typing them out. Okay. Also, we need to determine what you consider a laugh. More, more than a snicker, I would say. Like, I would say like, <laughs> like we go would be. No, that's okay. okay. I think that's okay. Like, so long as you don't be like, <laughs> like, if you do that, is that, and is cut that a off, laugh? That counts. That counts as a laugh? Yeah, like, if you if you do that and it cuts off, that counts. But if you're over there going like, what if you go, <laughs> to keep yourself from laughing kind of thing? If it's that dramatic, it's pretty <laughs> much a laugh. Kendra, no snickers. First rule, anything more than a single snort would be a laugh. So, so pretty much what we were thinking. Like, okay. just anything more than... <laughs> Oh hi, Kendra. I'm glad you're able to show up here. No Snickers. You're not you when you're hungry. Grab a Snickers. Yeah. (laughs) That one with Joe Pesci was hilarious. God, Joe Pesci's great. They had some good. uh, What do you mean I'm funny? (sighs) Oh yeah. Second rule: no breaks. Been here. Oh okay. Not allowed to give yourself time to recover yourselves before you move on. Oh, so like no pausing. Been here. Can't pause it. Hello. Hello. Oh, well, we didn't see you come in, but hey, welcome. Hello, hello, hello. What's all this, then? <laughs> That's a pretty good gorilla. Like, <laughs> That's a practice. <laughs> pretty good. Yeah, no pausing and no stalling. Well, Stalin's not around anymore, with so Stalin. it's fine. It's with Stalin. Yeah, with Stalin. What you talking about, comrade? <laughs> <laughs> so you, you can't contain the laughter enough to move on, you lose. All right, fair. Okay, and for everyone that don't, 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 don't everyone that don't <laughs> understand what we're doing, <laughs> if we lose, yeah. and we both can lose, that's true. This is not a uh, first person out situation. Right. MP has three shots. Gets to choose what we wear to they Anime Monterey coming up get in the a month. Dog collar and the nuts. New. No. no. MP no, gets to choose what be, we wear at Anime Monster. I was about to say, it might be embarrassing enough that we might opt for that. Yeah, because we have to wear this stuff Probably in not, public though. around other weebs. Yeah. yeah. If. And we are going to be doing some filming and maybe yeah. even a little bit of live stuff at Anime Monster, and hopefully we won't Okay, be compromise. It. How about the taint? How about we ain't? How about, yeah, <laughs> I'd rather wear... I'd rather wear whatever MP picks, That's, honestly. Yeah, that would really hurt. That thing, it, it, it's so I don't think my, my like, scrotum will be the same. That's a sensitive area. I feel like you pee yourself. If, if you set that thing high enough. Being and, that close to the zap, nut sack. Zapped your grundle with it, I think you'd pee on yourself. Being that close if to the nut sack. you had to pee, you'd pee. Yeah, being that close to the nut sack, you're going to feel it in your, your nuts. You're going to feel it everywhere. Yeah. Okay, so the first <laughs> is a video, and the last two are reading. Okay. One short story for each of you to read, so please do your best rant. Read slowly, Read slowly and, and accurately so, so we can, can enjoy, enjoy it, too. too. Eat my ass. <laughs> it's easy. Hooked on phonics is working for you, is it? I'm going to sound it sound it out and just make it just painful. <laughs> I'm going to make it painful for everybody. Taint. 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 Ah, got it. Yeah. Okay. So this is first shot. First shot. All right. All right, here we go. You ready? <laughs> I'm already starting to laugh. Mine. It's not fair. My How long neck is this video? Is bubbing. You like my neck? Five minutes. Stop bubbing. I see it. There's something wrong there. She is like Poppy, I adore you. I like baby, I ain't normal. Yeah. Foreigner! That's so creepy. That was scary. Yeah. 
cute when you eat those fries what the now go ahead get a taste of that big mac oh it's meat candy it's really good scary yeah. man Tusa. what's wrong with her are you but you know you belong to me <laughs> mp are you trying to make us laugh or like scare the crap out of her? that's a bad day he had some bad sushi <laughs> now that should have been set to mexico yeah, that would have been brilliant. Oh my God, she's about to pull a freaking Sid. That's Sid. That, that's Sid. That was actually kind of cool. Yeah. I'm Peppa Pig. This is my little brother George. This is Mommy Pig. Yeah, I'm confused as hell, MP. What are you doing? Ow. Where's your mama gone? What the? Where's your mama gone? Where's your mama gone? Where Dude. Can you really scream? Oh, yeah, they're buff, man. Dude, they will. Look at fuck you. Yeah, yeah, oh, rip this cable. That ain't even right. They will fuck you up. In Australia, like, really restricts firearms for their citizens. That's BS. That thing will whoop your ass. I want a 12 gauge if that thing's coming in my house. What the f. Oh, 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 oh. Here it is. Yeah, I do the same thing. MP. Swinging duck. This? Swinging duck. Is that it? Is that it? I feel weird after that. Yeah, my, yeah I'm a, I'm with Tomahawk on on this one. Things got weird quick. It's things we'll never unsee. She just trolled us all. Maybe she did. Cause it's things, <laughs> cause that was that was. Now there's a couple of them that. Kind of got me because of the repetitiveness. Yeah. Repetitiveness. Kendra. Sh For Stumpy. Okay, so this is Stumpy's read. Okay. okay. So just, okay. Read so just the this second one. one. 
Read the second one, please. So not this one. Okay. Okay, hold on. When you say second one, do we need to push the view entire discussion? I assume. Or are you talking about this one down here? Click, Click on, on 23, 23 okay. comments. Okay. And it's this one right Feet here. Feet for men. Okay. All right. <clears throat> okay. So, Amazon UK, Veet for Men Hair Removal Cream. After having been told my danglies looked like an elderly Rastafari, I decided to take the plunge and buy some of this as previous shaving attempts had only been mildly successful, and I nearly put my back out trying to reach the more difficult bits. Being a bit of a romantic, there. I thought I would do the deed on the Mrs. Birthday as a bit of a treat. I ordered it well in advance, and working in the North Sea, I consider myself a bit above some of the characters writing the previous reviews and wrote them off as soft office types. Oh, my fellow sufferers, how wrong I was. I waited until the other half was tucked up in bed, and after giving... This is so English. And after yeah. giving some vague <clears throat> hints about a special surprise, I went down to the bathroom. Initially, all went well, and I applied the gel and stood waiting for something to happen. I didn't have long to wait. At first, there was a gentle warmth, which in a matter of seconds was replaced by an intense burning and a feeling I can only describe as like being given a barbed wire wedgie by two people intent on hitting the ceiling with my head. Religion hadn't featured much in my life until that night, but I suddenly became willing to convert to any religion to stop the violent burning around the turd tunnel and what seemed like the destruction of the meat and two veg. Turd tunnel almost got me. <clears throat> Struggling to not bite through my bottom lip, I tried to wash the gel off in the sink and only succeeded in blocking the plug hole with a mat of hair. That's a funny word, plug hole. Through the haze of tears, I struggled out of the bathroom across the hall into the kitchen. By this time, walking was not really possible, and I crawled the final yard to the fridge in the hope of some form of cold relief. I yanked the freezer out and found a tub of ice cream <coughs> and positioned it under me. Thank you, Jelly. The relief was fantastic, but only temporary as it melted fairly quickly and the fiery stabbing soon returned. Due to the shape of the ice cream tub, I hadn't managed to give the starfish any treatment, and I groped around in the draw for something else as I was sure my vision was going to fail fairly soon. I grabbed a bag of what I later found out was frozen sprouts and tore it open, trying to be quiet as I did so. I took a handful of them and tried in vain to clench some between the cheeks of my arse. This was not doing the trick as some of the gel had found its way up the ch chutney channel and it felt like the space shuttle was running its engines behind me. This was probably and hopefully the only time in my life I was going to wish there was a gay snowman in the kitchen which should give you some idea of the depths I was willing to sink to in order to ease the pain. The only solution my pain-crazed mind could come up with was to gently eat... Oh, ease one of the sprouts where no veg had gone before. Unfortunately, alerted by the strange grunts coming from the kitchen, and the other half chose that moment to come in and investigate and was greeted by the sight of me, arse in the air, strawberry ice cream dripping from my bell end, pushing a sprout up my arse while <laughs> muttering, Ooh, that feels good. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! I think Under you lost. I, that I'm was sweating. that was a smile. My teeth, my actually, I think I worked one of my fillings loose, clenching down. <clears throat> oh my god, dude, that was. Oh my god. Okay, understandingly. <laughs> This was a shock to her, and she let out a scream as I hadn't heard her come in, and it caused an involuntary spasm of shock in myself, which resulted in the sprout being ejected at quite some <laughs> speed in her direction. I can understand that having a sprout farted again. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> It's the image. Fuck. I know. 
<laughs> I'm getting an I'm image sweating. of somebody going, burnt ow. <laughs> Fuck. Damn it. <laughs> he fucking got us. I continue, at, though. At 11 at night in the kitchen probably wasn't the special surprise she was expecting. <laughs> And having to explain to the kids the next day what the strange hollow in the ice cream was didn't improve my static. <laughs> so to sum it up, Veet removes hair, dignity, and self-respect. <laughs> Fucking Pete. I almost <laughs> got to the end of the, Having a sprout farted against your leg. <laughs> it's such an absurd fucking line. Dude, I was over here shaking. Oh, I know you were. Fuck. <laughs> Jeez, I thought we'd at least do better than that. No shit. We got through the first one. Yeah. I thought we'd at least, like, fuck. Wait a minute. Do you think she did that to, like, put us off? Possibly. Like, like that's <laughs> one of those weird things where you're in a different mood. Yeah. I think that's what she... You know what? I bet she went and Googled, like, psychological you warfare so? type shit. That's what I'm thinking. I feel yeah. like I just got, like, We got fucking played. See, I know you guys so well. I had to set you up to where you felt safe from the first one. That's exactly what she did. I don't know how I, I feel, feel played. About this. I think I she played us. I do. Yeah, I do too. What the fuck? <coughs> All right, you know what? Let's go here and see the second story. All right. This one was pretty fucking good. All right. That was fucking hilarious. That was great. Fair, it's fair. That's not fair. We Fair's, need to prepare. Yeah. No, I got it's Start clever. Looking at sad kittens it's, and whatnot. It, no shit. Yeah, we didn't have any. Yeah, that's what we should have done. So no, like, we're sitting. We're watching yeah. fucking Perfect Care Forever. <clears throat> Get this back later. <laughs> fuck this. That's cake. gonna make us laugh. We shouldn't have done that. Nah, I know. <laughs> I, 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 yeah. Rant. Right. I read. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So the first one. I assume this. Yeah. Okay. I purchased this after I was confronted by some punks demanding that I hand over. My money. I'm a relatively fit guy, but I was no match for them. That is when I realized that I need to protect myself. The day after I bought this product, I went to the very same Walmart parking lot when I was first mugged. I approached a group of hooligans standing outside the entrance, concealing my secret weapon. I coolly asked, remember me? One of them looked up and said, have you come back to buy some Samoas Samoas or Thin thin Mints? My Girl Scout troops need to raise more money. I replied, you're not taking my money this time. But, sir, they're delicious, he said. I whipped out my knuckle blaster stun gun, hand, and shouted, wrong move, bitch. The five Girl Scouts (laughs) ran away screaming. As I pounded my chest in victory, I accidentally activated the gun and applied 950,000 volts to my right nipple. I woke up four hours later to the sound of heavy footsteps. Those Girl Scouts had brought their fathers, but I was ready. I lunged at the largest one with a cry of raggle fraggle and hit him with the, hit him in the stomach. He hit the ground harder than a fat kid on a jungle gym. As the others began to circle around me, I changed techniques. Holding both of my hands in tight fists, I raised my arms to my sides and initiated the helicopter spin. They all backed, up, backed off, fearing my impressive RPM. <laughs> After a while, I started getting dizzy, and one of the fathers decided to try to tackle me. As he ran to me, as he ran to me, stood there, dizzy and queasy. This time was real going real slow. Then I remember I had eaten lunch at Chipotle. The burrito was fighting its way back up my stomach. I turned to my enemy and launched a steam of projectile vomit at him, knocking him to the ground. Then I started singing, let the bodies hit the floor, let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies do the... <laughs> I had to. I grabbed my knuckle blaster stun gun and shoved it into my... shoved it into my mouth, running headfirst at my foes. Electric... Electrocuting them with my teeth. Okay. Electrocuting. Let's make sure I was reading that right. Yeah, Electrocuting them with my teeth. Eventually, they were all unconscious, and I walked home victorious. What the hell was this person smoking? Can I have some? Are you sure you want some? That sounds like a neat fucking day to me. That sounds like so you want you, you so a neat day in 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 your world would be shocking your nipple, knocking yourself out for four hours, getting up, projectile vomiting your Chipotle lunch onto somebody, and then uh, electrocuting someone with your teeth. 
I mean, when you tell that story like that, I mean, no one's really going to believe you. <laughs> no shit, they're not. But, uh, it's not. That's a story nonetheless. Correct. correct. The answer is correct. <laughs> I, I think you're right. I'm not going to argue that. I, know, I feel like I could have got through that one. Yeah, that one I could have got through. Of, and I but, get to, to be fair, I almost got through that other one, too. But the line, having a, br- a frozen sprout farted against your leg at 11 <laughs> at night, is just too fucking absurd. <laughs> It makes you that wonder. That was what it got. I got up to that point. I was fine until then. Here's the funny thing, though. <clears throat> it was so detailed, it had to have happened. What? The 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 Brussels the sprout? sprout. Yeah, the and sprout the and the sprouts asshole. And the, yeah. guy All, the whole story. Giving it to the ice cream. I yeah. mean. It was so detailed. It was. It had to have happened. If it wasn't, that person needs a job for creative writing for somebody. Yeah, he needs to go work for fucking Star Wars. Yeah, he needs to. Disney, any, hire this any, guy. Anybody should give that guy a job. Right. Anybody who does even the least bit of creative type of writing should give that guy a job. No shit. But this, this one, one would have to probably push y'all over the edge if he hadn't fallen completely already. It was really just a backup story, but I was positive it wasn't necessary. He already works for CNN. <laughs> if only they were that entertaining. I would That's watch the it. Thing. Exactly. If any news outlet was that entertaining, yeah. I'd fucking be watch it. Be full of shit, but at least be funny. That's all I ask. It's not yeah. that hard. Now, if you're full you of shit can be f- and serious, exactly. And if you're not just funny, actually full of shit and take it seriously, nobody wants to see that. No. If you're gonna be full of shit, at least be funny. Exactly. A little effort goes a long it, way. It does, <clears throat> especially when it comes to comedy and humor. Exactly. Wow. Yeah. I was thinking we'd have done better, but I, I think I think that video, that first one, was like, it, it was it, 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 it was such a weird frame of mind that that crap put you at after that. It's yeah. like, it's like what the fuck, you know? I, I will say that you that, played us, and that, I can't believe that, you. That lizard Barbie was kind of cool, though. I would, that I would was definitely tight. put okay. one of those on my wall. <laughs> I'll put one of those in here. We could. We do. We we should get one. You want to go buy a Barbie? You got to make one. Well, you got to make that shit. They don't sell those. Could you imagine if the, like you tried to pitch that though? That would be awesome. What, what do they call the the reptilian underground people? Anunnaki. An- Anunnaki Barbie. Dude, you've got to be all inclusive now. That's your thing. And we could market that. Yeah, I feel like people would buy that shit. We need to email like the Barbie who is it? who does the Barbie As, Hasbro. Is that Mattel or Hasbro? One of those. We big need to toy email companies. them right now. Are those even both companies? Hasbro's like board games. I think I that's know. Mattel. You ever watched Tim Mitchin or Randy Feltface? Purple Puppet? Uh, I can't say that I have. Meat Canyon. Purple Puppet sounds pretty dirty. Yeah, it Not going to lie. Awfully dirty. That sounds like something like when you meet somebody at a, at a dive bar and you know they're just you know, looking for a lay. It's, hey, you want to meet my purple puppet? See, no, that <laughs> doesn't it sound exactly what it sounds like. I was like. thinking that, like, that would be something that was said amongst like. Your your brethren at one of your parties. I was thinking it was more like a pickup line. That is possible. Hey, chat, I've got some pretty diabolic ideas for them for anime mochery, but please send me some ideas you no, have, and I'll Chad, be happy that's to incorporate not necessary. stand-up comedy. Definitely watch some. Okay. Now, it has to comply with their... All, all chat needs to do is ignore MP. Oh, thank you, Tomahawk. Thank you, Tommy. For 500 turds. Add 10. Yeah. Um... <clears throat> Everyone needs to ignore it. Stand-up comedy. Definitely watch some. I'll just check that out. And what we can do is, um, you know, we can actually delete that entire message. What? We can strike it from record. Yes. The wood court. The wood court. I mean, they don't write nothing Nothing's ever proven in the wood court. Nothing's ever proven in the wood court. We should have declared wood court rule. And then we could have been like, it never happened. Exactly. Prove that it happened. Walking But but then again, I think they can... Like, go back and they'd have clips. I can delete it. this entire episode. No one will ever know the we difference. We could. Yeah. Couldn't we? We could. Never happened. We have a nuclear no option. No proof. We do. do. Must we push the red button? Nothing yeah. is too ridiculous. Give me your evil. Shut up, MP. Yeah. I was about to say, just know this This whole thing could disappear. You know, we do have a new... No witnesses. Ep- I'll have it downloaded. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I have a nu- We have a nuclear option saved on a hard drive. That is true. Like we have a real we one. We have a nuke yeah. we have a nuke episode we have a, saved on a hard a drive. Real one. It would not do We will destroy this bitch. This yeah, this show and would not be look back. far beyond redemption on that. That would make every news feed ever. I have eight witnesses who are also paying customers. I'm just, I'm just saying, like I mean, if, yeah. if we ever turn that one loose, that's the end for this show. 
If you ever see this, and you'll know what it is. Oh, you'll know. You'll we'll know. put out an, an an announcement beforehand because this is this ain't so much as burning the bridge as it's dropping a freaking nuke from orbit on the motherfucker. Scorched Earth and pissing policy. on the ashes. Yeah. If we yeah. ever get to the point where we're just like absolutely done with 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 the show, and yeah. Because you know, let's let's say someone keeps coming after us for oh, us just knows? having a good time. Whatever it whatever may be, to, whatever the reason may be, we have an episode that we'll release. And when that episode's released, we'll keep it up as long as possible. In grand fashion. Yeah. The only way that we the, could. This is the uh, this would be ending the show's equivalent to setting yourself on fire in five o'clock traffic. <laughs> like, it would be very noteworthy what happened. And we'll keep it up as long as we can. Yeah. It's, but it's, then it's, once you see yeah. the episode, that means the show's done. It's oh, over. Yeah. No, that's the that's setting the timer and walking out. And, and we're going into hiding. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, that's one of the ones where you're 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 going off grid after that. But anyway, you don't have a choice. So just another day in Beaumont or Houston. Just about yeah, pretty much. No, this yeah. would this would cause a stir. Oh. Suffice it to say, uh, we we probably have people with uh, torches and pitchforks oh, sitting outside our yeah. studio if we continued after oh, yeah. that. Yeah, that would be epic. But it would be pretty but awesome. It may never happen. I don't want it to happen. It, it, it's like but we have this. It's option. like nukes today. They just sit in their silos for the most part, just in case. <laughs> just in case. Just they're in there, case. But they don't really do much. Because YouTube, fuck you. Yeah, but they're there. <clears throat> so just know it's there. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, I, I, I was hoping we'd have done better. I, I feel like we got out. out we got no. We got one. fucking played. I don't like that. We got played. I don't like getting got. Me like neither. That. Get got. Yeah, getting got it. We got we we, we got got it. We got got <laughs> getting gotten got gotten got gutted. John Gotti. Jan He's in Gotti. prison, isn't he? Uh, who's John Gotti? He was a uh, mafia boss. Huh. Hey, Timmy Two Toes. <laughs> no, this guy actually was like. Tiptoe by the window, to the window. That's where I'll be. Tiptoe through the tulips with me. Oh. You do that too well. I know. <laughs> if only I knew how to play a ukulele. <sighs> and then to think they played one of those songs on SpongeBob. Dude, the like time. Light, loving in the moonlight, having a wonderful time. Okay. <clears throat> there's a it's, theory. It there's, a, there's a theory behind SpongeBob. What? That he's a fucking sociopath? Not just that. No, he is. Well, yeah. Think about it. that motherfucker did whatever the fuck he wanted. Like a- anybody else's shit, be damned. Yeah, he was a sociopath. But you know where that ha- he where, was. where that was he supposeded cried to be at to manipulate people. He you know, cried all the fucking time. Do you know where that was supposed to be at? Where? At one of the nuclear testing sites. What? Bikini bottoms. Oh, was it supposed to be? Oh, you, you it's know, a reference to the to making at all. Yes. Yeah. Okay. It's a reference Dude, to the testing. You know site. they fucked up on the calculations on that. Yeah. And they, they had used lithium seven as part of the uh, reaction on that. Yeah, they're stupid. Unanticipated consequences. They're ended stupid. Up, the yield was like six times. Bikini at all? Yeah, yeah. So that whole thing with them underwater. Yeah. Was them changed like to radiated from radiation? Yeah, I could believe that. It makes a lot more sense now. Right? Yeah. I don't know how a squirrel got down there, but that's you know. a good ass question. She was from Texas, though, so it's a Texas squirrel. She'll probably handle it. We're going to take a short break real quick. Is and it that time? Yeah, it's about that time. I got to piss. <laughs> you're not dreaming. Are you, sure you're not. Awa- <laughs> Are you sure you're awake? I don't know. I think so. Ow. <laughs> maybe, yeah. maybe one more just to make sure. I got I to be even. Left side. Yeah. Ow. Nice. I think the mic actually picked that up. I think so. That hurt. Not bad. Okay. We're going to take a short break, and we'll be right back. Enjoy the you know, legit question. Why why is it only Jumanji when it fucking sucks? Like why why every time things are like, oh, this shit's happening. No, no, you, I'd rather quit. No, it's Jumanji. It's only Jumanji when it sucks. It's never Jumanji when it's fun. You know, if I if I was in Jumanji, I'd I'd do like that other guy and just spend like the rest of my life inside of Jumanji. That way, I don't have to worry about the consequences. He of seemed everything to do else. fine. Exactly. We're gonna stay in Jumanji. He so was fuck wearing y'all. that fashionable ass, uh, fashionable ass fig leaf shit. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, so, done yeah we're gonna that. stay in Jumanji. Yeah. Could have done with that. Could have your Jumanji rules shit. Yeah. Could, yeah, it's just freaking. Yeah, it sucks. Uh oh. What is that? Oh, that's... Marshall Islands nuclear testing. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Though, I will say that's also was like an ongoing thing because inadvertently they ended up, uh, like, yeah, yeah. It's, it's it's fucked up the way it actually happened. Like, yeah, the, the whole story behind it is pretty fucked up. 
because they didn't expect what they expect. I want to say the yield was like 12 or 14 megatons, maybe more. It might have been as high as 25, if that's the one I'm thinking of. There was, uh, no, no, no. Okay, is this the Castle Bravo nuclear test? Yes. This is the Castle Bravo nuclear test. Yeah, 500 north of the equator. No, no, no. I want to make sure that's the one that they mentioned that it is. Because the test that they really fucked up on was called Castle Bravo. That was the code name for this it. This is Marshall Islands. Yeah, I can't remember. There was also one detonated at a place called the Macon Atoll. So I don't know if this oh, is... The concrete co- oh, this is the concrete coffin, the tomb, that is uh, war- starting to that's collapse. That's where they set it off. Right, I but guess. this is... No, this is where they buried it, and this is starting Jeez. to collapse. Well, I had seen a thing the other day. They were talking about uh, in some parts of Chernobyl, they started picking up uh, higher emitted... Uh, radiation and because places. the elephant's foots leaked through fucking everything well, by now. That settled into the basement and finally cooled to the point where it's only emitting, you know, lethal radiation. I think in uh, with like four minutes, except for the part of the sarcophagus that's leaking into the water table now. Well, what it is, yeah, yeah. What it is is it's leaking that. Uh, uh, I guess the rainwater has actually provided some energy to some of the more. Uh, it's only a marginal increase, and they say it's right. consistent with like you know, a leak. Yeah. So they're having to go back and find where the water's leaking into it to shut that down. Yeah, it's it's crazy over there. Yeah. No, let's see. <clears throat> yeah, so, yeah, 67. I didn't agree to shit, and you have no proof. That's true. Not not technically proof. There was no signed documentation. Yeah. Besides, everyone replied to my idea. They might not like it. Yeah, no one likes it. You should just stop. No one likes it. I'm what? sure they'll get... 44 messages deleted by moderator? What the hell? Oh, Tomahawk posted a link. And oh, jeez, Tomahawk. Yeah. You really pissed off Hot Bot Carl. Yeah, Hot Bot Carl's on your ass. Yeah. Yeah, freaking. But now, that's that's freaking nuts, man. <laughs> yeah. No, no, like, look up Castle Bravo nuclear test. This is the one I was thinking of. Yeah, see? This is the one where they fucked up on the calculations. High yield thermonuclear weapon design test, the Bikini Atoll, Marshall yep. Islands, and part of Operation Castle. The device was the most powerful nuclear device ever tested by the United States in its first lithium deuteride fueled new thermonuclear weapon. The yield was 15 megatons of TNT, two and a half times the predicted six megatons. Okay, here's the thing when you talk about like one megaton. <laughs> I'll buy I'll guess my tushy. One megaton more is a whole lot fucking more. Oh no! When, not when you're when you're when you're talking about yeah. megatons or anything that has to do with explosives, yes, that's a lot more. That's one not, two times. Yeah, or or like a like a it's, two it's, percent it's, it's increase like is this, a lot. Yeah, yeah, it's it's yeah. But so two and a half times a two hundred and fifty percent increase, right? Is like it's fucking unfathomable. Yeah. It's like you, you're you're putting in calculations on how far away you need to be for six megatons. Yeah, it was way more than that. You're not far enough away for fifteen. No. If you're far enough away for six, that ain't doing you shit. But you know, there is a perfect distance. Also, can I share my three honorable mentions? Yes. Yeah, whatever. Also, there's a point that you're at the perfect distance. They have perfectly cooked hot pockets and people. Yes, uh, I know. I'd done some reading a while back on the uh, the SAR bomba test that the Russians carried out, and I want to say it was like fifty megatons, and they said that uh, could cause third degree uh, or could cause burns, like initially from a distance of like sixty two miles. Damn. Yeah, dude, that test broke windows in Finland. Finland's three thousand miles from where they tested it due to atmospheric focusing. Uh, was it cloudy? No, what it is is uh, what, what like cloudy, have, cloudy conditions and explosive. No boy, no. Yeah, but what had happened is the sheer magnitude, the energy of this explosive, it went up, literally, and came back down at an angle due to curvature of the Earth. And when that energy came back down, it came back down over Finland. <laughs> so the, they tested the weapon. They detonated a thousand feet above ground level, and the fireball didn't even reach the ground because the shock wave was so powerful. Damn. Yeah. It's impressive. Dude, like 50 megatons is, is is unreal. So you could have laid underneath it and watch it. Wow. Yeah, before you became <laughs> one with the earth for freaking ever. Not even your fillings would be left on that. Nah, that's enough to vaporize everything. Let's see. 
My dog, my dog loves, loves them. Dog loves these shoes. Not too big either. The dogs love them. Dear AKC, your long-lasting bone <laughs> lasted all of five minutes. If that's your idea of a long-lasting bone, then I feel sorry for your wife. That's pretty Damn. funny. Damn. That's pretty funny. That's pretty good. That's chuckle-worthy. Yep. Good lube. Amazon. It's lube. Not too much more to say. Sometimes I cover my body in it and pretend to be a slug while slaughtering. Oh, gross. I don't even want to. Ew. There's some reason I can actually picture, like, me doing that. Just, I'm a slug, yay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you know what? Do that and see. see, uh, see let us know how that goes. It's fine. NPS clean it up. I know. Me. That's what I'm saying. I, I can imagine. Uh, Wee! <laughs> To be fair, it would be partially her fault for showing you this. True. So she's an your, enabler. You it's have her your fault. chance to go. I have, a, I have my chance to get her back. Yes, you do. Do it. Be a passive aggressive ass like nature <laughs> intended. Well, thank you, the mountain. Well, that's some shirt. It's a shirt. Do you get that for chili? We need to get chili one of those. And play an arc and all that. I need to make it a chili, so, chili, chili dino. By the average consumer. I bought this T-shirt for my son, Jeff, two years Wait, ago. That, it, that's how you pronounce that. Some people spell it that way. Geoff. It's Jeff. Geoff. Jeff. Jeff. Remember the skateboarder, Jeff Rally? Jeff. Do you remember that? Yeah. That was how he spelled it. You fucking weirdo. Yeah. Jeff. So, chili source. Chili source That Rex. sounds like something a restaurant has as an eating challenge. Chili source. Oh. It? It's all, I hey, imagine, what's wrong with you? I've got the chili source I'm in my a, ass, I man. imagine it's a... I wasn't going that way with it. Well, when you eat I was high spicy shit and you have to shit it. It ain't got to be spicy. I was picturing a massive, hole. massive nice chili cheese burrito. Chili sauce. Yeah. I'm talking about like a, like a three-pound chili cheese burrito. Something <laughs> you know is just going to punish you. Uh, chili store ass. So tell Mark, one of my buddies took an empty Purell hand sanitizer container and filled it with astroglide. That is fucking hilarious. <laughs> that is great. Okay, I'll keep reading. Yeah, yeah. We got my boss. It's hilarious. He was like, this hand sanitizer smells like shit. He smelled it three That's times before funny. finally washing off. He's probably wondering why the shit didn't rub in and his hands kept feeling slick. <laughs> you, fuck, 20 minutes fucking later, you're like, what the shit is you going on? You put lube in my hands? Yeah, what the shit is going on? Yeah, but yeah. his hands were really soft. Uh, <laughs> I knew he loved dinosaurs, but I didn't realize it would escalate into an obsession. He now goes around the house pretending to be a dinosaur. He would take the eggs from the fridge, go to the toilet, stick get up his colon, then when he felt ready, would go on to the driveway for all the neighbors to see, drop his pants, and poo it out like a dinosaur on its period. I guess that's... Ha- Is this anato- a kid? Anatomically, how are we about to find out, I feel like. Sadly, he's gotten so involved in this dinosaur life that he's leading that he, I fear he has now slipped into a spell of extreme depression as none of the eggs ever hatch. I see him crying on the driveway and desperately sticking his hand up his bum, looking for more eggs that might hatch. This how can how can not only caused a decline in his mental health. I think the decline was already well before. Uh, yeah, this I think t-shirt. this like this came. But this I'm also concerned for his anus. We're having to use temp. Jesus Christ! I can't even read that. Read it. I'm concerned for his anus. We are having to use tampons on his bum to stop the leakage. He stretched it too far. Some, some days the show just sucks the soul out of my body. I fear this is not normal behavior for a 29-year-old. Oh, fuck. Most of his old friends are married, and some even have children. The doctors are now incredibly worried. Now incredibly worried. Now. About- now. Not before. Yeah. Now. Of- this was all gravy until, you know, five minutes ago. His anus is now beyond repair. I'm sure it is. He sometimes wakes up screaming at night. Sometimes. So, I'm sure there's some anuses in the porn porn star industry that uh is beyond repair. That's about you know that's probably who should ask for help. Some of them yeah, might. How, have, how do you so, how some, do you yeah. qu- uh, keep from shitting pancakes? Yeah, yeah. So some of them might have that'd be the uh, you know the crew to ask. If anybody's gonna know, it'd be them. Fuck. Okay. So that story. I wonder how many of those t-shirts they sold. <laughs> do you think it's just like a cursed shirt? Like it, it's like it's like that. It's it, it's the t-shirt of dinosaur. Uh, colon madness. I got a question. Okay. How many eggs can he fit in his ass? (laughs) (laughs) 
You know, I bet the number started out in single digits, but as the description went on, it was probably up to a dozen. I guess it's a good thing they don't keep ostrich eggs in the fridge. I wonder if he moved Jesus. to that. I wonder if he moved to that. God, dude, man, you talk about somebody that could hide a grapefruit. That's not good. That's not talent. That's I bad. I can't believe I actually am curious on how many eggs he can hold in his No ass. longer a chili ring, more like a chili hoop. That ain't no lie. <laughs> This gave some honest giggles. Yeah, yeah, it did. That yeah. was, uh, geez. Yeah, that's why you, you, you got to hope with pretty much most of your being that. That's that not was, real. Yeah, that that was made up. I hope. <clears throat> but if not, how many eggs can you fit? That's something. That's why we have VPNs. <laughs> that's why we have VPNs. That's why we have questions like that are why we have VPNs. <laughs> In case you were wondering what they're really for. <laughs> so you can ask questions and honestly and get your answer. Yeah. Jesus, man. You know, uh, we need to get a uh, VPN like company to sponsor us. He's probably yeah. from Beaumont. Now I think he's more probably Canadian. Maybe. Yeah, he's sticking those pine cones up I their ass. There's, so there's you a, know there's there's a what, a hundred and thirty something thousand people in Beaumont? Yeah. That's think about the potential for how many fucking weirdos that is. Well, there's two right here. Well, I'm not from Beaumont. Neither one of us are. We're not from Beaumont, but I mean, we're I'm in Beaumont saying, right now. I guess technically. You're this unincorporated, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Still Beaumont. Well, not really, but okay. Uh oh. What is that? Please, we're begging you. Do not stick 15 eggs up your butt. All right. So apparently the answer is 15. <laughs> <laughs> Is this real? <laughs> Is this fucking real? WebMD does not recommend egg suppositories. Well, how else are you going to get your vitamin A? <laughs> or your protein. Or your protein. A lot of vitamin A in egg yolk. Dude, the egg. Yeah, the you egg. think? Couldn't have drawn a better face on it for that. Oh, no. <laughs> Man, how'd you like to... You remember the uh, school assignment where you had to take care of an egg? I never did that. You never. I never did that either. No. But that was like it seemed to be like a trope or something like that. Like people, they always depict. How that. many of those people put eggs in their ass? That's what I'm saying. Like how many? How many eggs? Got, how'd you like to fail your assignment because you wanted to see if it could? And that's the easiest fucking thing in the world to cheat on, isn't it? Yeah, you buy a new egg. Hey, no fucking shit. You just have like a pocket <laughs> full of the fucking things, or you hard boil it. This isn't really inclusive material for the furry community. Some people are role playing. You know, there are the ones that are birds, but I've never heard of them taking it that far. I had to do that with 12 eggs for CPO initiation. (laughs) Sounds like a Navy thing. Tomahawk. He's a Navy guy. Oh, oh, fuck. He's a Navy guy. Never mind. Yeah, Yeah, he's a Navy guy. That explains it. All right. If you asked him, (laughs) not the anus, just taking care of them. Yeah, bullshit. Yeah. So you didn't count, you didn't quite hit the fifteen mark. I'm so sure you're you, safe. I'm sure you took care of him. All right, he took it. All right, <laughs> <laughs> he took it and didn't care. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Read for better or worse, but probably worse. People just love to stick things in. And that's why they switched to package a flower when I was in school. <laughs> probably this exact reason. You know, kids put everything in their mouth. Nowadays, kids put everything in their Early ass. Early on. But one recent case report will make even the most <laughs> jaded among us wince. What are you trying to avoid, Stumpy? Uh, what you stick any, in your mouth? Anything you have it to say over there. <laughs> it all started with a report published last week in the Dutch Journal of Medicine. Okay. So this is coming out of the Netherlands, titled Step-by-Step Approach to Rectal Corpus Alienum. In other words, how to remove foreign bodies stuck in a patient's rectum. It's be- a truly noble cause. It's bad that they've had to, like, th- there's a term for that, you know? Mental hospital. No, apparently it's rectal corpus alienum. So you like eggs in the bum. I just have to point out that the term for trying to remove something from someone's anus, the last four words, numb, in them. In them. <laughs> <laughs> How funny is that? <laughs> Gotta remove it in them. Yeah, in them. Yeah. Ah, the oh, Richard Gere syndrome. Oh, it's in them, all right. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, the paper begins. Patients who visit the emergency room because of foreign bodies in the rectum <laughs> are certainly not exceptional. In recent years, the problem has even increased. I think we need to go outside. Hey, hey. Go outside, Chili. Just. 
top margin. Subscribe for four the months. months. You slacking? Yeah, uh, Chili. That is for four months. Yeah, thank you, Chili. We thank you so much for that, man. We appreciate that. Always appreciate it. Four months, damn. Mm-hmm. Have you been on Twitch that long? I <laughs> know. How's that going? Oh no, <laughs> we've been on here longer, but we've been yeah, contracted I, with Twitch for four months now. They haven't caught up to us yet. I, think. I guess not. So hype train, yeah, chili hype. Yeah. In recent years, the problem has even increased. On the basis of three different cases, we present a step-by-step approach for the removal of a rectal corpus alienum. They have a step-by-step approach. Step-by-step. This is stuff is out like, yeah, yeah, anal removal. Uh, a, yeah, rectal corpus alienum for dummies. I wonder if you can find that at Barnes and Noble. <laughs> You know what's funny is when it gets to the story, you see yeah. what the age of the patient is. And it's one of those it cases makes that me is wonder maybe. if that's the same person. Maybe. Patient C is a... To- they're both the same age? That's what I was saying. Makes me wonder wow. if they're the same fucking person. Uh, what, what is it? Could be. Patient C is a 29-year-old man who came to the emergency room around midnight because of acute stomach pain, the study reports. Together with his partner, he had Uh-oh. anally inserted 15 boiled and peeled eggs while under the influence of GHB earlier in the evening. GHB? I think that's one of the uh, date rape drugs. Ah. So. All right. So he got date raped by a bunch of eggs. <laughs> and it, the thing from Twitter, that's all in Dutch. <laughs> Shall, should I try the Dutch or no? Oh, no, 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 no. GHB is a drug that can be used for, for treating gene. narcolepsy. And most da- famous, famous for the, Oh, okay, so okay, right. okay. So, so yeah. he got... Ich dent dat diese Miner nut mir 15 gepelde in gekookt ihren in zingen ane stopt. Something about a butt, I'm yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, butt anus stuff. is pretty freaking self-explanatory. <laughs> Apparently, that one translates across all <laughs> language barriers. So do farts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Who knew? So, yeah, I'm going to take this drug, and I'm going to shove this thing in my butt. So, by the time the gentleman got to the hospital, he was suffering from an abnormally rapid heart rate, tachycardia of 120 beats per minute. Fuck! And a rapid breathing rate of 28 breaths per minute. Damn! A physical exam revealed abdominal guarding across his entire abdomen. I don't know what that uh, is, but it sounds it, bad if it makes you do that. It can make you go septic. <laughs> it, it's it's a type of back Sus- blockage, and also it can cause tears in That's your lower intestines. That's terrible. <laughs> terrible. See what I did there? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Visible in the CT scope. Oh, suspecting abdominal sepsis. Okay. The doctors gave him a CT scan, and what they saw was not pretty. But I bet it was pretty damn funny. At least initially, they're like, what the fuck? Is this, you know, like... They're probably like... You're the eggy motherfucker, aren't you? Space, do we have to take him back? I think that's a one-way deal. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Visible in the CT scan. Yeah. Boo, boo, boo. Boo. So, visible in the CT scan were a perforation in the sigmoid oh, pelvic colon and yeah. a considerable amount of air and fluid in the abdominal cavity. Again, that sounds bad. Therefore, oh, we deemed an emergency laparotomy necessary. Surgery. There is some weird sex toy that you load alien eggs in, and upon finishing your pump, them in alien fetish, I guess. You're fucking kidding me, right? But why does Kendra know this? Like, Kendra, tell me. I'm not even gonna ask. No, I know, but it's like it's one of those things where you want it to not be true, but you zombie know ass toy of the dead. It happened on there. Yeah, it did. It happened on there. Yeah, it did. This is a Kendra's little- friend this- told us. You're her friend. You may want to reevaluate that friendship. <laughs> You're her friend. Are you the one that told her? Uh, if that's the friend telling you these things, don't fall asleep at that friend's house. Just fair don't advice. take D- GHB if you Male have a friend. Definitely don't fall asleep at that friend's house. Okay. Yeah, so, have fun. Is, lap- that, is that Mari's Phil lifestyle? I guess. Jinkies. Yeah, there ain't a jinky strong enough to describe that. There, no. There's not sufficient verbiage in the English language to describe. <laughs> Jinkies and alien laid their eggs in my ass. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Fucking hell. A laparoptomy is a surgical procedure in which a large incision is made through the abdominal wall, allowing access to the abdominal cavity. Uh, Right? And a revelation that will shock approximately nobody... Forcing 15 eggs up your rectum is not a good idea. <laughs> what a fucking thought. The doctors confirmed a large... <laughs> she said, fuck y'all. She had her fetishes, but none involved aliens. I wasn't judging. Hey, we're not judging. Just, I mean, 
that somebody made that shows enough people had interest. That's yeah. what's. We're not judging it. We're not kink shaming. You have your crazy. kink, enjoy your kink, that, whatever. That got to the point. That got past idea to production. That went from, is this a thing? This is a thing. Let's design it. It was, it was designed. Prototypes. Yeah, it was designed in prototypes. Trial and error. Th- this thing was R and D. This thing was engineered. R and D. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, whatever they call that thing. Verified by the Pentagon. I don't doubt it. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Doctor, yeah. That's the anal probe they use. As well as extensive inflammation caused by feces <laughs> leaking into fecal peritonitis. Uh-oh. <laughs> What'd you do? <laughs> did you do something without thinking? Apparently. I did. To describe Jinkies, an is. alien laid their eggs in my ass. <laughs> yeah, you should have thought that one through. <laughs> oh, fuck. I should have thought that one through. Yeah, Damn you should have thought that one through. Do you think about what you've done, because <laughs> they'll be playing that. The, <laughs> the, the eggs were oh god, god. So, Doctor Scout. Yeah, okay, so so this okay, dude, so they were still there. Peritonitis. Like, so this dude was in a bad way. Like, suf- that means be a TikTok. Shut up. Suffice it to say, this dude was actually in a, this was a legit emergency. Yeah, he he didn't remove the eggs. They're still was, in his fucking rectum. This was life threatening. Yeah, like, let's let's let's. Funny stuff aside, this was actually legitimately life threatening. Yeah, you stick fifteen th- eggs up your ass. You're, you're gonna, gonna have a bad time. Gonna have a bad time. If you stick fifteen eggs up your ass, you're gonna have a bad time. I don't know why that sounded like an old radio guy. Yeah, why? Why that? Why that? It just seems like something you hear on the radio in the 1940s. Yeah, and we're reminding everybody that if you stuff fifteen eggs up your ass, you're gonna have a bad time. <laughs> so the eggs were removed as well as we could. Yeah. <laughs> And the abdominal cavity was thoroughly rinsed. Or his ringtone. Shut up. After the operation, the patient was monitored for a short time in ICU. After a few days, he was able to leave the hospital in clinically good condition. It was on a talk show. What, eggs in the ass or the alien sex toy? I was about to say, what the hell freaking talk show was that? Granny at midnight? Oh, shit. Yeah, she probably would have. That was a dirty old bag. But she man. wasn't into kinks. She just had like dildos. What do you mean and shit? she wasn't into kinks? Have you seen like half yeah, the shit? Yeah, there were was dildos hawking? and things. Well, yeah, but not alien. Trust me, that claws that sprout eggs into your rectum. Yeah, these things were fucking robotic. They swiveled and shit. I mean, it was. It's different. They like advertise like how much this shit moves. Fuck it, wiggles like a worm. Pretty much. Like yeah, we call this one, you know, the freaking fish out of water. Why do you call it that? <laughs> <laughs> you know <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Do you get a point? <laughs> no, no. Please reiterate. <laughs> fuck you. It's like the guy with the the broken robotic arm. Exactly. Exactly. All right. Chili said with this one, we need to read the comments. Oh, okay. But even though this adventurous patient seems to have come out of it relatively unscathed. We're pretty sure medical professionals would still recommend against this particular proclivity. Yeah, I would too. Yeah, yeah, I'll file that one away under bad idea. All right. So 14 eggs is the limit. <laughs> right. Apparently, scotch eggs add an extra uh, layer of sensation. Please note, pickled eggs don't work. Cracked eggs up, up his crack, crack whilst, whilst on, on crack. crack. Cracking story, cracked me up. Well, that, uh, don't that just crack you up? Who would have... Had the forethought to hard boil more than a dozen. You think they had to boil some more when they realized all 12 went in? No problem. That's true. Did they have to go back to the store? Think about that. They might have purchased a dozen. You can get a 24-pack. And an 18-pack. Yeah. So, yeah, no, that's fine. Okay. Just add mayo. Okay. Problem solved. Ew. <laughs> oh, show me potato salad. Don't knock it till you tried it. Cool hand Luke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. Yeah, if you looked it up on the hub, it, this would be. No thanks, I'll stick Fuck! to yellow crooknet squash. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Uh, I don't know. That sounds French. Fifteen love. Fifteen love. Talk about tennis. Ah, that's freaking. It's a score you can get. There's more. Wait, there's more. Show, show more. Show more some comments. Show more potatoes out. A dozen, I would believe, but fifteen is such an odd number. <laughs> Jungle chili. Gives a whole new doesn't. meaning to Humpty Dumpty. Yeah. Has anyone contacted the people at Guinness? <laughs> Pure protein, straight in the ass. Didn't work well. I am close to the case of the jar. I don't know what that... 
You've heard of it. Okay. It was an answer to two girls, one cup. The guy did uh, one guy, one jar. I never saw that. I didn't either, but I've heard about it. Mason jar. That sounds foolish. Up the rectum. That sounds like a bad idea. It broke. That sounds like he died. He did. I sincere, Lacerations I in the sincere, rectum. Which is fed by arteries, people seem to forget. Severed two arteries. Yeah. Died within 15 minutes. Imagine that going yep. bad. So Okay. Ask me a guy. <laughs> I, I thought I'd have you a guy. <laughs> so we had a fucking ridiculous case some years ago. Two old rednecks, drunk, engaged on some weird sexual game. One of them came to the emergency room with some nuts, two hammerheads, and a glass handle from a beer tankard. They uh, said uh. they tried to smash the husks from the nuts with the hammers. True story. What? The, what the, you didn't even mention the case of pouring concrete. Did somebody do that? Wait, what? I don't know. That's, this guy says that. But did somebody actually do that? Pour concrete in their rectum? Yeah. Were they trying to take a cast? See how deep they were? Like, what the fuck was the purpose of There's that? There's already a study that shows you. Yeah, exactly. We had we, that on an episode. We covered that. We co- yeah. Yeah. You didn't we have covered to. covered the length you of the have, rectum. You didn't have to resort to quick crete. Oh, fuck. You ever had it all dry on your hands? Yeah. It hurts. Can you imagine what it'd do to the old starfish? Woo. I, that can't be real. I would hope not. That can't be real. I hope not. Sounds MP, like you had a Friday. link. Up here, uh, a little we miss while one? ago. Yeah, she put a YouTube up here. Oh, uh, did we miss this? <laughs> oh, so Martin and Bex. <laughs> yeah. No, she didn't. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, spraying oh, that damn. right on your face? Okay. Oh, damn. This is going to be bad. Maybe they're trying to take a cast of their termite That's mound. That's kind of what I was thinking. Like, if, if it, what, do, what, what the fuck would you do? It suppose suppose that went well, and it went how you thought. Are you going to put it on your coffee table and wait for people to ask what it is? Oh, yeah, that's are, my rectum Are, are you going to set it around the uh, coasters and use it how as a conversation it piece? Because it's not like a straight tube that you can just take and pull out. I assume you have to get like a ratchet, like a come along or something like that. It curves. Yeah. I don't know. It would look like a crazy straw. Look like a concrete crazy straw. (laughs) So Anyway. (laughs) Oh, man. I don't know how they stay together. That's his daughter. Oh, that's his daughter? Wait, did I open that one? Dude, his wife's mom, filming. Her mom is ruining that kid. I know he stinks. Not from here. Have you ever actually used that like legit After liquid shave? ass? No, no, legit liquid ass. Yeah. I Pikachu's know. car. That there? wasn't liquid ass. That was just fart spray. You had liquid ass once. You bought some. You ordered some a <laughs> long, long now. time ago. That kid would be at the orphanage. <laughs> <the next> right. <laughs> so, uh, why are you getting divorced? Well, here's, dude, I'm thinking this would be the only guy in the world that could win his divorce case by showing these videos. Right? I think this guy got it, man. Not in America. You think even you're this? You're a guy, you're a piece of shit. <laughs> you're a white guy, you're a piece of shit. Well, I'm pretty fly for a white guy. <laughs> That poor guy. Dude, right on the ball. Dude, it's gonna it's right there. <laughs> he can't get away from it. No, it's he'd have to peel his skin off. Oh fuck. <laughs> Don't blame me, it was you. It was on mum. It was on mum. It was you. Yeah, it was on the It's in my nose. No, it's you, Casey. Don't blame me. It was you. How the fuck do you tend to that situation? What do you do? What, 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 what do you do? How do you fix this? What would you do? Yeah. What would you do? Oh, well, yeah, uh, pop, pop quiz, hot shot. You know? Pop shot. Try not to puke. Pop initially, shot, kids, hot shot. Yeah, uh, initially you would try not to puke for sure, but... How would you get rid of that? Bro, I don't know. Because it's an oil. Is it? It's kind of oily. That's fucked. And if it's in your nostril... 
you might get an infection. You think? Possibly. I mean, any foreign body in your inside because that, that's a membrane. That's a very thin yeah. membrane inside your nose. I'm thinking it would just hang out there until it faded. That's fucking. Or terrible. you lose your sense of smell. Yeah, what would you? I think I would literally down like half a bottle of this just to get rid of my sense of taste and smell. Speaking for a of while. which, what we that, might be having someone come on the show. That's pure evil. Though. That we're gonna pay twenty bucks. That bottle's like five to take years. a small bit of a straw. We're gonna put a straw in there and take about that much okay. up. Hold that up to the camera. That what you're looking at at the top oh, of hold this. Hold on, let me change the screen. Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay. What you you see this clear liquid at the top? That is like pure capsaicin oil. That is what that is. Oh yeah. Thanks for hanging out, Tomahawk. Thanks, Tomahawk, man. Yeah, yeah, Take yeah. Care. Always. We always appreciate your uh yeah, you know, the continuance of our depravity. Uh, absolutely. We we like to have everyone's input and but what we'd that like to bring is, you down to our level. Is purely But you have a good night, man. Purely the stuff that's hot. That is a thick layer of capsaicin oil. Yep. So I have somebody. Who do you know that's that fucking stupid? Just I'm it's a legit question. Uh Charlotte, her boyfriend. Oh, okay. I was about to say, I didn't think she was dumb. Yeah, please, please don't break that. Because that's fu- yeah, I didn't, I didn't see what was going on. So. They had lu- he had lunch with us today. It was uh, at work. It was all you know, all the texts together. Okay. And he decided to come with us to lunch, and we got we. I was eating some gumbo, and I, he was talking about spicy stuff. How he had some ghost chili pepper sauce. He said it was absolutely delicious, best flavor ever. But mm, then this hot. Some of hit it him. does taste good, but it fucking. But, yeah, it's. That. But he likes hot stuff. I was like, I got something for you. I had a mango I habanero him, chutney one time. That was that tasted fantastic. I told him, come on our show, come okay. to our show live. I will give you twenty bucks for which one. Because this is habanero. Pure this capsaicin. This is reaper. Pure capsaicin oil. Dude, and not oil. only that, this is reaper sauce. But get a, he's going to get a straw and get about that much inside the straw, put the whole thing in his mouth. 20 that, bucks. That's This is reaper, man. He's thinking about it. Most The pro, the thing about reaper and what I've seen, uh, when most people eat it, it tends to make you vomit. Well, who needs $20 yeah, that's that no bad? shit. Hey, his philosophy is 20 bucks is 20 bucks. That guy's gonna have a long weird life. He, he's a lot or younger. Or a short than, weird life. Yeah. But a weird life nonetheless. But we might be having him on the show one day. I think what we're gonna do is have a waiver first. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. Because that bottle's like five years old. So I don't know. You know, this is gonna be what fun. What would he even do at this point? That's why it's concentrated so much at the top. Well, we've been needing to have guests, and what better way to talk guests than to doing stupid shit? Three inches of fucking pure capsaicin oil in that bottle. Yeah. Ugh. That's stupid. <laughs> I can't believe you do that to me in the eyes of all of you. <laughs> the way he <laughs> talks. <laughs> you know, but you could have told me. You could have warned me. What kind of clothes have got on that stinking of shite? Shite? Stinking of shite? Spraying it, won't it? We keep smelling it. Everyone does that. Come <laughs> here, you fucking change it for our spray. Our I spray. Fucking rice stick in a shite. It wasn't me. It was Casey. It was she could have showed us this too. I think this would have got us. Oh, you're so bad. Not the bad thing. She's lying. She's lying. She's lying. She did it. It looks like he wants to cry. He does. <laughs> Still stink it. I, hold on, hold on, hold on. This would have made me. I can still it. stink it. Yeah, that's what it's. That's what the freaking what thing does that mean. Dude, I can still th- stink the it. The guy's suffering, man. Cut him some slack. Oh uh, yeah, I can't think. Imagine though that I knew it wouldn't. It would be necessary after that one video and story. I, I still don't like that she actually. I, th- I feel like she researched it. I think she did. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't like it. Me neither. Oh, she was bragging when I went to go get the drink. She was up there bragging about how she knows our personalities so well and she knows how to manipulate us and all that crap. Uh huh. Yeah. I don't like it. I think we need to um, rethink our employees. Some <laughs> <laughs> fire. I don't know if it's fireable. That might be a bit too far. But, but we'll bitch about it. <laughs> We're going to bitch a lot. Oh, We're going to bitch about it for sure. Yeah, I can smell it.
toilet. And a piggy swap ship. Freaking funny. Uh, he says, I was less bragging and more bringing, bringing to your attention how much I know about your personalities and how I can manipulate to my advantage. I don't know. Uh, sh- you, yes, I feel like. But I, I don't know. The, I the, let her. The full extent of, of, of my personality, I don't think she has Like, I, I let you do it. It's fine. Yeah. I mean, you're, you know, married, so. I let her do it. It's fine. Yeah. Oh, you do? Yeah, yeah that, that, I, I let her do it. That helps preserve your ego? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, <laughs> makes me feel better. She's making you wear That's all. She's making you wear I'll let you do it. Yeah. Yeah, so sorry. Make you feel good. I, 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 don't, I don't think she's got my profile completely mapped, but, but she probably knows just about all about you. Well, she knows yeah. mostly about me, but you're not far off. Yeah. That's the sad part. Bring me right. down, man. <laughs> yeah, I am. You got to be freaking crabs in a bucket around here. Just dragging everybody down. Crab people. Crab people. Checks notes. Y'all aren't too much different, to be honest. Yeah, no yeah, shit. Yeah, that's the sad part. It's, it's probably We do true. share that one brain cell that, like, rubs together. Yeah, occasionally, yeah, it's like, it, you know, they, they get on the same frequency and it gets projected. And it's it gets like, bad. Yeah. But it happens. Yeah, I mean, so, you've seen it on like a yeah. on a what some people would consider bad, us consider good oh, yeah. when we are like Man, on point. This blue is like holding on pretty. Dude, good. that blue is tight. I've washed it twice, and it that's holding better than the green. Yeah, this holding I mean, better honestly. than the purple. Yeah, and though so far the purples was the one far and away. You remember like even when we uh, bleached it before we did the chrome. Yeah, because remember trying to bleach the purple, the shit turned green. Yeah. And then when we put the chrome on it, it turned blue. It's like, right. Fuck, yeah, you no, couldn't we, couldn't have, win. we couldn't have replicated that color again if we wanted to. There were so many fucked up steps involved. Pretty much. But that purple, it, my hair was still purple. And I was, I must have washed it like 30 fucking times. I mean, it's that blue still looks good, yeah, especially in the light. This blue is, is still blue. Yeah, it's still blue. Blue. And, and think blue. about it. We've got, what's the date today? The 8th. We got practically a whole month. Like, so we'll have to probably touch it up before we go to. Yeah. You know, Blue. Anime monster. I mean, we would have time to change it if if, if you wanted, wanted to but change. it sounds like I, MP is going to. I kind of like the blue, but, I mean, I, I'm fine with it. If MP wants to change it, that's fine. If, I, I'm if, sure she's got something up her sleeve, and I'm not sure if it's actually going to involve, you know, well, regardless, your hair being gonna covered be or not. Well, you I need to I mean? know ahead of time. You know what I mean? Yeah. Furry. <laughs> Honestly, I think you started this whole furry shit. I, mm-hmm. Actually, I know for a fact you did. Well, yeah. I already told you I did. I, yeah. I, I, I'd, I'd, I'd let you run with that for a long time. Yeah. Then, 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 no, normally, like you said, we, we could figure each other out. But on stuff like that, I think you didn't want to accept it. Of course not. I don't want to. <laughs> I decay that it would be necessary either way, but y'all will have to decide who will be the... Oh, Jesus, no. Mm. This, Okay. <laughs> I don't know what their rules are there. That's within rules. How is that within rules? I don't know. As long as you're not showing ass, dick, badge, or tits. (laughs) (laughs) Well put. (laughs) I'm not kidding. MP, I checked. (laughs) Check again. (laughs) Check again. I I think I think a second opinion is warranted in this case. I'm going to send an email, and you know how I'm, like, not tech at all. I'll figure out how to properly word it and everything and send it Are to Are you going to be a Karen? Yeah. Yeah, you'd be to, a Karen to, to keep to that from happening. The, yeah, you damn right. <laughs> Karen the shit out of this. Oh, that's terrible. I'm worried. That is that is, that is is so bad. I might have to get. I might have to drink some milk that weekend. <laughs> we ain't getting that security deposit back if that happens. You can kiss that goodbye. Hey, bring me some more fresh styles. Yeah. Man, you go through a lot of those. Yeah, I'm shit up a storm in here. Hey, y'all Rochambeau to the death, so I know who's who. I have an advantage on you with that. One, I have a metal leg. Two, you've had a, uh, work done. 
have an idea for that. If we were to Rochambeau, we both, you, you, you would not win that. I have an idea. Okay. I'm not going to say it where she can hear. Okay. I have an idea. All right. Good deal. Because... Because if, if that were the contest, you, you know. Candy, like, don't encourage her. That's just, it's unfair. Like, that's unfair in my favor, and I'm actually being sporting and saying that. It's, if, it's if we, fine. I okay. got it covered. Don't worry. You don't punk out now because you lost. No, I'm not. No, nah, no. Nah, I'm, I'm saying if we Rochambeau'd for it, that's not even a contest. His Rochambeau would automatically yeah. win. He's got a metal I fucking ha- I leg. I have a metal friggin' leg. <clears throat> I mean, it's not like they're doing any good. They're just hanging there for decoration. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Okay, fine. Then flip a coin. Well, that we do have. This thing's decided. The Super Bowl. It's yeah. We're not flipping the coin now. Things there. We're not flipping the coin now. Why not? It's fuck you. That's why. <laughs> it don't matter. Whatever. I guess. Rock paper scissors. Yeah, we rock Inter- paper scissors. Intermediate discussion. We Hold ro- on one second. Okay. All right. <laughs> we, we, we've decided. And it'll take a little bit to. to yeah, we decide. get. We're gonna work it out. Yeah, we will. We'll so. work out the terms. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't think she trusts us. No. No. Not not a bit. I don't think so either. It's fine. I'll put a possum in the bed. Hey, whatever works. Now if we have if we have to go to the hospital because rabies, well, we just won't go that weekend. You know, I gotta say, I've caught them. I've never had one attempt to bite me. They're pretty docile, except they for that s- devil one. I sent you a video Dude, of. Dude, the one your old man caught in the tra- trap. That thing was possessed. It was possessed. Listen, Chad, I already knows y'all lost. You might as well just take your lumps like Ben. No, we're gonna bitch. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna bitch. <laughs> we're gonna bitch and attempt <laughs> to no- we. Okay, let me tell you what's gonna happen. <laughs> one, we're gonna piss and moan the whole time. Two, we're gonna try to weasel it out of this <laughs> any way we can, <laughs> including and not limited to delaying tactics. And you know, it's being saying, sick that and weekend. We don't feel good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my I, tummy's uh, making the rumblies. That only hens can satisfy. <laughs> so, you want to get a bunch of ice cream? <laughs> oh, jeez. Classic. Man, like, hey, fuck. <laughs> I don't know why that hurt. Ow. <laughs> ow. <laughs> candy. <laughs> ow. Uh, it stung a little, candy. Damn. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Ugh. Oh, yeah, heck I don't kids. even want to know what she even has like planned for that. That she already the, said she didn't specify. I don't. I don't. You don't need to. Yeah. Said with much love. I'm sure. Oh, no, I'm sure. Yeah, there was a ton of love in that com- in that comment. And that's yeah. why. That's why it stung so. Good. Yeah, it stung so good. <laughs> it stung, stung so lovingly. It stung so yeah. good right here. I did with perfect clarity. Obviously not. What I don't know. She has an idea. I know it. I don't even know the idea, I but I don't know. Even knows exactly. <laughs> Something's wrong with that TV. Is that a fart or shit? Can't yeah, you, tell. You better choose wisely. It was a fart. So an idea I'm considering is making one of them either burn. Okay, I'm, let's delete that comment. Yeah, yeah, I'm deleting that comment. It's fine. Jesus freaking. That delete. Can That's I delete that awful. comment? Delete, 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 oh, delete. She's right. Fuck. Stop oh. spamming the chat. Oh, man. No. No. I'll, I will no. ban you for like no. five minutes. No spamming. <laughs> How long do we got left on the show? Fuck it. We're over. Right. We're done. We're it's it's close enough. <laughs> oh my god! No, that's awful. I'm sure everybody in chat thinks that's a terrible idea. Yeah, you you, you, did, you know life. you could have everybody in chat be like, "Nah, don't do that." Thank you, Candy. I thought it was perfect. No, I mean, y'all are supposed to be on our side here. Yeah, I think that's all the time we have for today. I hope that's, hope that's all the time we have for the day. I'm just, I'm, I, I just. I'm you're reading, go, you're it. reading it over and over yeah, and I'm over like, and over. It's getting somehow worse. So can I ask who is the master and who's the color? I don't want to ever answer that <laughs> question. <laughs> ever. Please. <laughs> We're going to get the wrong kind of numbers. Ugh. 
Like, MP, this is something that you're going to have to deal with as well. You understand that, right? Uh, Yeah. I feel like she's better piece. Phone numbers and people coming up to us. Uh, it's going to be uh, your fault. Go, uh, no. We not, we're not more than two feet from her if this is happening. <laughs> we're going to make sure everybody knows she's involved. I have an idea. Do you? I do. A, a, a passive aggressive. Uh, oh, even worse. Oh. Even better. Oh, even better. Good. All right, MP. Talk about popularity. Talking about something uh, for all the wrong reasons. All right, MP. You know what? We're we're we'll play your little game. We'll play your little we game. We will. I have an idea. Okay. All right. I'll. I'll, I'll I'm trust a daddy. you. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, that's gummy not worms. That, that's that's not it. Oh, okay. That's not it. But that that would work. It's yeah, funny. I, 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 could, I could be part of it. Just throwing gummy worms at her. Pelting. Pelting. How much, at, what is the biggest bag of gummy worms they have on Amazon? I bet we can find a I big one. Bet we like could, a five-pound bag. Big old Halloween bag of those motherfuckers. Yep. Might Talk increase followers. About popularity. Uh, yeah, we don't want those. You okay, do look. still have to buy. Okay, now that is the one thing about all this, no matter how far off into the uncanny fucking valley it gets... It does have. They do have a TOS. Yeah. Or not a TOS. Like a, uh, like a code of conduct, a yes. standard. Yes. That has to be met. Right. So that does somewhat temper and, how bad it can be. And whatever we wear has to be TOS compliant because there are going to yes. be parts of it we are streaming, as yes. well as TikTok. So, so it has so, to. Okay. So well, I I've seen some shit on TikTok that they, 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 a lot goes there. But we are actually a professional show company. <laughs> when did that happen? By did you just call us professional? By um, uh, not not by our standards. I mean, oh, I mean, okay. Like, we are. I was, about, I was about to walk out. We are technically a company. Yeah. Okay. We yeah. we we are a show underneath the umbrella company of Stashastic Films. I'm not a show. You're not a show. Take your brain out of there, Carl. I'm going to go do that. So, we are a show that's underneath the umbrella company of Stash Tastic Films. I've seen shit on TikTok that I can't unsee. That's what I'm saying. Yep. I don't think we get much saving grace there. So, you can't be loud and obnoxious in public. Fucking bet. Mm-hmm. She says we can't be loud and obnoxious in Oh, she knows that ain't true. We've already done fucking that many true. times. Uh-uh. And we've already proven that. I walk out of the office every day since I've gotten this you death whistle. This? Oh, fuck yeah, I am. I walk out of the office every day. Going to my vehicle to leave, to go home. That's against convention rules, though. You risk getting kicked out. Depending upon how bad this is, that might be an acceptable outcome. Right. They can't keep me out of my hotel room. (laughs) I guess that's true. And you could. (laughs) They can. They can and they will. Kick you out of the hotel room? They should get my money back They can refuse service. I suppose they could. Technically, being a private enterprise, they can. But then we have Stumpy. Oh yeah! You show oh, the star. Oh yeah! 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 Babe. Go ahead. Kick yeah. out a wounded veteran. Yeah, Go ahead. Babe. Hold up. Let me let me talk to you. I've got yeah. one yeah. leg, yeah. and you're about to kick my ass yeah. out of here. Let me let me talk to you over here real quick. Come on, buddy. Oh yeah, that's no. how that conversation's gonna go. Yeah, you have to like <laughs> ham it up. Oh, like you know I will. Yeah. I'll limp over. A bit. <laughs> Come on. Come you on, limp buddy. over. <laughs> you li- you walk over, but you limp it back. <laughs> I will. Oh yeah, in that case, absolutely. Damn right. The reviews that would be left about that hotel Poof. and the way they treated a wounded veteran. Oh, man, yeah. It's, oh, it's yeah. Like we would end worse. them. When I have you on tape being wild in public, they will kick you out, LOL. Well, then don't put us on tape. Yeah. But said, well, who the hell are you tape? What are you talking about tape? tape. You got to no, br- no. break out of VHS? <laughs> you know where the high eight is? <laughs> That's old school. Digital. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got to get jo- digital. Digital. <laughs> Join us in the digital age, MP. It's, it's wonderful. Coming from someone that hates it. I know. It's not that great. You're so analog. I am. Very. And shut the fuck up. I am old school. <laughs> <laughs> just just, just be forewarned, MP. There's going to be a lot more passive-aggressive comments and snide remarks. Oh, yeah. Tossed about here. Luckily, we only have to do this for one day. I know. Out of a four-day convention. It's a it's a build-up, though. I anticipated that. Okay, good. But, but we do have to have time. It's going to be a long day. It's going to be a long day. 
We do have to have time to do stuff for the show and everything well, like that. So That's not going to stop us. You know the best time to do it would be Sunday, the very last day of the convention. Why is that? Half the people are gone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good call. Good call. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta make it work. I, I still also assume that once it's out of your system, you make the bet right and just get it over with. Yep, on you Sunday. Think, you th- <laughs> <laughs> this is a Sunday. Yeah, bet. yeah, we we're getting up that Sunday. Oh, we were gonna do that. Oh, let's let's order breakfast and hang out here till like freaking three o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, the convention's over at one. Oh, it's oh, over at one. Oh, what bad. time is it? Eleven forty-five. Well, I guess we could get dressed. <laughs> I mean, that might be worse though. Less crowd to hide in. Uh, that is true. Less people it. to recognize us. But the thing is, we're not a very it. big show. I doubt anyone's going to recognize us at that. all. Yeah. But it would be cool to have to sign an uh, autograph. I'm not. As not, not like that. Not okay. Like that. No, 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 okay. No, 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 Think about what you're asking. No, 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 no. All right. Oh, um, uh, have we told everybody the update about Hofstetter? I don't think we did. Okay. Did you ask him, is he cool with that? With what? Saying what's up? I didn't ask, and I'm not going to go into detail. Okay, then don't. I'm just going to let everyone know. We spoke to Hostetter after the show, um, and I've been talking back and forth with him here and there. He's doing better. He's still got a long road to recovery in the hospital. He uh, didn't specify, but yeah. So he'll be in there a little bit. Everyone, send your best wishes, pray, uh, you know, prayers, whatever. Yep. Uh, his way. He uh, would like to have him hurry up and get well and. Come back and hang yeah, out with us. Can't rush that shit. Yeah, no, not after, not after that. Nope. So, anyway, it is about that time of the night, and we've got to say goodbye. So, thank you all for watching. Thank you, Chili, for the resubscription. Four months going strong. Yeah, all the bits for playing the funny, funny fucking sounds. Yep, and the farts MP say, and the one howl thank and the one howl that. and the farts. Yeah, yeah. absolutely, howling farts. Ha- If you could it do a howl, if like you that. do a howling fart, we got to record that. The, well, of course. I mean, just straight up. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna sell that as the what do they call that? The NFTs, non fungible transfers. Just there you go. Yeah, I'm gonna sell that. I'm gonna make money off of that. If I could fart with that level of talent, I'd have a job doing it. You can count with your ass. I can do that. So, I wouldn't go around telling people that though. No. What's your talent? I count with my ass. I don't put it on my resumes. <laughs> you should. I, sh- I might start. <laughs> you put it on your resume. I might start doing that. That's something that we uh, could actually do here on the show. What? Have you or have us fill out a resume online for a job? Why would we do a full thing like that? Because we can say funny, funny, funny things. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we could. And put some funny references on there, too. That we could. Yeah. Kendra and Candy, what's your phone number? <laughs> <laughs> you may get some strange calls. <laughs> Anyway, that is all the time we have for tonight. Thank you all for hanging out with us tonight. He won't even fill out a bio for OnlyFans. We need to do that. We need to put your stump on OnlyFans. We'll we'll get around to it. You're afraid of making money for your stump, aren't you? Not really. If I could make that kind of money, (laughs) I've heard of what some people make on there. I know. I ain't afraid of that. (laughs) What's afraid? What's keeping you? What I would have to do to make that. <laughs> you dress your stump up all nice and in lace and everything else and just dance it around. That is just, Why are you twitching? Yeah, that was weird, <laughs> man. That was weird. This is weird. <laughs> this is weird. But anyway. You rub it in mustard. No, okay. Thank you all for hanging out. <laughs> Y'all been awesome. <laughs> and we will catch you Thursday, 7 p.m. Central Standard Same Time. Same bad time. Same, same bad place. Channel. And we'll catch you all next time. Ladies. See ya. Fuck the producer. <laughs> Dude, that sounded great. All Fuck the way the to the balls. <laughs> that was hilarious. That couldn't have been timed out any Fuck better. Fuck the producer. <laughs> <laughs> we figured out a winning combo. To- yeah. You're going to be hearing that a lot, MP. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> 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 Oh, man. How have we not found that sooner?